really can't believe it's now going to be a year since COVID. I have not stepped foot in my school since last March. I miss it so, so, so much. Like in the back of my mind, I figured this wasn't going to just be a little break. We wouldn't go back for the rest of the year. It was going to be the year for us. It wasn't the senior year I had hoped for, and there was a lot of ups and downs, a lot of downs. I do like going, traveling away games, you know, having fun on the bus with the cheerleaders. Doing what feels like the same class over and over again, regardless of the subject, and the homework assignment is just on my laptop again, on the computer for the, what, the umpteenth time that day. I feel like nothing's changed because it's all run together in one big amalgamation of days. You just wake up, you go to bed, you do school, repeat. Connecting with teachers has been so hard this year. I like seeing things. I like using my hands to learn. It's virtual, it's not really the same. I've found that my motivation recently has been lacking a lot. We are transitioning back into hybrid. And even today, when I went back to school already, it's up. I got a lot of work done, more than I have at home. I haven't really seen many friends other than a couple of track teammates throughout the year. Some of my friends have changed. I've had to make choices about who I consider my friends because of the choices they make with COVID. I have gotten close to people that I never thought I'd be friends with, and I have distanced myself from people that I thought would be in my life forever. I used to go to the movies and go out to eat all the time. Both of those things were like some of my favorite things to do with friends. All of my friends are stressing out right now about colleges and like picking and choosing and getting accepted versus not getting accepted. It is really scary not knowing where I'm going to go to college yet. I got into my dream school, which was amazing. I made my choice. I want to go to Birmingham State because I want to be a high school history teacher. I think a lot of it is looking at what you can be grateful for. I am working at the food pantry today. My job today has been running with carts. We're supposed to have 500 customers today. You know, the numbers are starting to drop. I'm hoping for a prom this year, you know? We're talking about having a prom, but who knows? I'm 18, so hopefully I'll be able to get a vaccine. Even though it will be different, I'm just hoping that we can still have an in-person graduation. I'm just really thankful for my support system that I have. I've definitely personally changed for the better. I'm definitely not the same person I was before 2020.